Aconex workflows help you manage documents through a review process, but they go a step further to actually systematize document reviews. Once Workflows is enabled on your project, your admin can set up workflow templates. A template defines who reviews the document at which point in the review process. It also gives each person a certain amount of time for their review, which helps the review stay on track. What's great about it is that you can reuse that template again and again as fresh batches of documents come through. Once the template's set up, the admin makes it available to people with Workflows initiator privileges on your project. These are the people who can start a workflow and manage the review process. They choose the template that best suits the review process they want a batch of documents to go through, and they set the workflow running. Aconex automatically sends the documents through the workflow according to rules the workflow's admin and initiator have set. Now, here on my tasks page, you can see I have documents awaiting review. Each of those is in a workflow. Let's click on one. I have a number of documents I need to review in this workflow. These may or may not have been reviewed by someone before me. Here I can download the document to review it, and over here I can set the outcome of my review. That outcome affects what happens next, whether the workflow continues or ends. Here I can add any comments I might have and attach markups, and over here you can see I have a deadline for each review. If I need others to review the documents as part of this step, I can start what's called a sub-workflow of my own. This is like a mini workflow for just this review step. It makes my job a bit easier. But of course that's what workflows are for, helping you manage reviews. Don't forget to have a look at our other information on workflows here on Aconex Support Central.